so hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's been a while i've missed youtube and i've missed you guys so much um i decided to take a break but i have no like um like valid valid reasons of why i took a break because i was i i think it was like i think it was just an excuse because i was telling myself i i really need a a new gadget that shoots better than my phone currently currently i'm shooting with my phone and um my phone has served me for so long and i think the quality is going down it's not as perfect as i want it to be but anyway god's time is the best and very soon i'll be an iphone owner <laughs> yes 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 i'm told that iphones shoot better and i know that iphones shoot better i've used an iphone once before and i really love iphones so god please today's on a sunday hear my prayer i'm really rooting for an iphone this year anyway guys today's on a seven on a sunday yes and it's 7th of july oh yes saba 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 today is saba saba 2024 and guys first things first today is on a sunday why 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 am i not even in church anyway let me explain why i'm not in church in the first place so today i woke up and i was feeling unwell like i was having really really bad cramps and my hubby told me to like rest like because i really wanted to go to church like so bad so bad so he just told me like take take a day off rest until you feel better and he'll go pray for us so anyway guys that is the reason why i've not gone to church and also the major reason why i've decided to do this vlog the vlog i'm about or whatever i'm about to say right now it is the most most requested video but i just don't know why i normally don't have the guts to shoot this video like but today 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 is the day so guys while i was seated here i was thinking by the way i was using these bottles to kupunguza my cramps pain <laughs> i really need to to buy that bag kile cha kuweka majimoto instead of using bottles but they have helped and they have served me well anyway guys while i was seated here um guys i'm not a good storyteller i don't know i bluff sometimes i get distracted i start bluffing i get distracted but anyway straight to the point while i was seated here let, let me go back to the point while i was seated here i was thinking i was just having my quiet time my 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 alone time and a certain thought came like i remembered something back those days like while i was campus i w when i was in campus Today the grammar is not grammar in. but anyway those days while i was um a student i'm still in campus i used to have bad 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 really 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 bad crafts and i would tell my boyfriend and the only thing that my boyfriend would tell me then was siku moja nitakupumzisha for nine months guys you already know what that means Anyway, guys, by, by the way, okay, let me get distracted for, for a bit, kidogo. You know, before I got married or before I moved in with my boyfriend officially as a husband, my mom and people around me used to tell me that once I get married, the cramps will, like, they'll sub, subdue, is it subdue or subside? Like, zitaenda, like, they'll stop being painful the way they are. But they have not they have not stopped so um it's either i'm not married or they are just here to stay <laughs> because they were assuring me once i get married they'll go they'll go but what anyway guys after my boyfriend told me that at anipo musician for nine months he he manifested his words and they came to life like
So guys, after my boyfriend told me that at a uh, for nine months, he did it. He did it actually. He did it by impregnating me, and that is now why I'm seated here to tell you a story of how I got pregnant and how I found out that I was pregnant. I'm not going to give specific timelines because of my village people. <laughs> the reason why I'm saying I'm not going to give a specific date of um, how the events or when the events happen, it's because they will call them village people <clears throat> because they are gossipers. They were speculating like when I got pregnant, did I really finish school? Did I get pregnant like while I was still in school? Did I even graduate? Well, the most important thing is I got pregnant after school and I have graduated. So guys, this is how I found out that I was pregnant. I'm going to give a, like a story like I'll take you back to Dogo. So, uh, we have dated, we, like, we have dated for, I think it's nine years. This, this year will be nine years. And while we were still dating, my boyfriend used to tell me that he really wants a baby at 25. And I would assure him, I would tell him that, mm -hmm, ni at 25, he'll get a baby. And on his 25th year, <clears throat> year, I knew that I'm supposed to give him, give, I'm not, I'll not say give him a baby, I'll say give ourselves a baby because it's something that we wanted. Like it's a goal, it's more of a goal that we wanted to achieve at that time. And on his 25th year, guys, uh, fast forward. The first time we tried and we were trying jokingly it failed or probably i i was not following my calendar closely to realize that probably i'm not on a fertile date so the first trial it failed but i pranked him i pranked him by telling him that that the test came out positive but <clears throat> Called. But anyway, I pranked him by telling him that the positive came out, uh, the, but that the test came out positive, but that was not the case. The test was negative. But anyway, we laughed it off, and that was it. However, guys, uh, before we even tested, I remember I was so scared. I was so scared of testing because I don't know how I'll explain this. Um, the moment you are looking for that baby and when i say the moment you are looking for that baby guys you understand that moment i was so confident that i really wanted a baby but the moment i realized that i could be pregnant i started being scared and i thought to myself like am i ready uh what does a baby want and the moment the test came out negative guys the first time i was disappointed i don't know why but i was so 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 disappointed anyway after the second month we try again and voila it happened and it happened this way guys now this is where now the juice is. I woke up one day. I was supposed to like receive my periods that day. And I woke up so grumpy, so moody. I even chased him out of bed and I told him, At that moment we were living together, but we had not moved in officially. It was just a ile tuku visitiana ku visitiana. So I woke up and told him, so you just go and make tea. Kwani mi ni takuwa na make tea every day. Nini, nini, nini. Well, he was so shocked. But anyway, he woke up. Uh, went ahead to make me some tea. And then afterwards, 
I started telling him I don't feel okay. I was supposed to like receive my periods today, but I've not gotten any. However, still I'm not feeling okay. It's like I'm feeling sickly. I don't I don't understand what I'm feeling. So I told him I'm going to the pharmacy to get a pregnancy test, just in case. So I went on to the I went to the pharmacy and I got a pregnancy test. Kaleka fifty bob the the strip the strip pregnancy test guys you know it. So I went got the pregnancy test and I tested deep down in my heart something was telling me it will definitely come out negative like like it's negative I just cannot be pregnant like the thought had not hit me that I could be pregnant and it's possible that I'm pregnant so I went <clears throat> so I went to to the loo to, to my to my bathroom I tested and he was waiting patiently for the results in the living room. Okay, not living room, but I'll call it a living room, but still we were stay up then we were living in a bed sitter. So I go and the moment I test guys, I see one line. Yes, guys. I see one line. And I'm like, okay, well, let me go and prank him as usual as i do so you catch up with the pregnancy test on top of the nini bathroom cabinet and i went out to see his reaction and the moment i came out from the bathroom he was singing he was happy he was calling himself a father and then i asked him mm -hmm. so, sir, nani amekwambia you are a dad nani amekwambia you are going to get uh, who told you you are going to be a dad yet you have not even received the results you have not even seen the pregnancy test results why are you gassing up yourself and then he said all this time i've been trying to impregnate you <laughs> so um the evil self came out of me and i took a biro pen and i decided actually feature biro pen I think I was wearing a short. Na niende ni chore. Like hapo bafu. I'll pretend that I'm going in to the bathroom to pick the results. But <clears throat> I'll go manipulate the results. So I took a biro pen and went. Shock. Guys. I took the pregnancy test. And before I could even draw my third line, there were two lines already. Yes. Two lines staring at me. Yani nilishtuka designingine sijai shtuka. And for a moment, I was confused. I was having, I, I can't explain this feeling. I was happy, happy and confused at the same time, feeling ready and not ready at the same time. I even can't explain what I was feeling exactly at that moment. So I took the pregnancy, pregnancy test to him. No, actually, uh, we met at the door. Nikitoka to the bathroom, he was start standing out waiting for for the results so when you nili muonyesha hivi kwanza nilitoka ata ata guys ata, hey these things happened in a span of seconds like nimeingia bafu i've i've like nimeona test it is two 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 lines and immediately nimetoka inje ya inje ya bafu like ni kama nime storm out and nime shout immediately niko like oh my god and he was standing there started hugging me because i don't know he tells me to to this date that something in him was telling him that i'm actually pregnant but me seek one honor come on possible i don't know i just don't know 
So he, he started hugging me and at that time I'm in panic mode. I'm so confused. He started hugging me and then I told him me And then he's like, "What? Is is this not supposed to be our feel good moment, the moment that you've been waiting for for so long?" I tell him, "No. In fact, I want you out of my house." These things are happening sim simultaneously in a span of seconds. I'll not even say minutes because those events were happening faster. As I recall, they were happening faster. So I, so I tell him, just get out of my house now, pote and go. He starts calming down. I go like, kwani ni nini? I can see two lines. Are we not supposed like to rejoice? Is this not what we are looking for? Um, are, are you not happy that you are going to be a mom and me a dad? And and I tell him, please stop, 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 stop. I'm just having a lot to deal with right now. Can you just get out of my house right now? So he respects me and he goes. And now I'm left alone in the house. Oh yes. So the moment he goes out, he leaves me alone in the house. And at that moment, I'm super duper confused. I don't know what I'm feeling. I'm just having a roller coaster of emotions, of thoughts, and I'm stressed all of a sudden. So I pick my, I take my phone and I decide to call my best friend, my friend who never judges me. Actually, I'm anything crazy. So I call her and she's like, hey, hi, how are you? And surprisingly, I don't respond to that. It's like at a I just told me, like I just immediately to I can use a hi how are you? Nico, like I think I'm pregnant. And then she asks me, Why do you think you are pregnant? Like I can just imagine the look on her face. That moment I'm telling her I could be pregnant. I was like, Why do you think you are pregnant? And then I tell her, I just took a test and it came out positive. It has two lines. And immediately, I start thinking. My boyfriend sometimes can be, could, could have pranked me. Sometimes he's cunning. But again, I was seated with him all, <clears throat> all that time waiting for the results. We got to go to make up a moji in the living room. Could he have manipulated the tests? No. So my friend tells me, um, he, he starts soothing me now. He starts by, she starts, not he, she starts by asking me, so what is your plan? What's next? Now, if you think you are pregnant and you have really tested and you are sure that the, that the, that the test is positive, now what's next? Now, what are, what's what what are you supposed to do now like what is your plan and i remember at that moment i start over, i started overthinking about my baby's school fees guys i just did imagine like um the the cost i'm at the length of time when i'll stay pregnant nini nini all even the feel good of the any the, the good feeling of being a pregnant no i straight my thoughts go straight to my baby's school fees. Anyway, so I tell my friend, I don't know for now. I'm happy and still disappointed. I feel like I'm not ready and I don't know what I'm feeling. So she, she tells me, uh, pick your pregnancy test. Now, this is very funny, by the way. This is very, very, very funny. And I think everyone deserves to have friends like this. So she tells me, take the wrap, your pregnancy test, and I take it. And then she tells me, Ebuso Mahapo Imeandikwa made in what? And I go through the test and it say and it tells me made in China. So I tell her it's written made in China. And immediately we start laughing. <laughs> and then she tells me, Hata we unajua that it is made in China. Mingi zina kuanga fake. So the pregnancy the pregnancy test, the test could be fake as well. And I'm like, yes, ata siji nini nilikuwa nafikiria. And I'm like, yes, 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 babe, th this could be possible. This, this is a possible, like, this could be possible. It's possible that the test could be lying. It's possible that the test is fake. However, deep down, I know the test is not fake, but we are just laughing and we just forgot about the whole story. And immediately, like a good feeling 
comes to me and I start feeling positive, I start feeling good. Like the some energy just came to me and I started feeling good all of a sudden. I started having like before before I even got pregnant I was having baby fever. Like uh in Genda Instagram and when I see baby posts I'll show my boyfriend and tell him, Oh my god, look at this baby, the baby is so cute and I feel like I have a baby fever, what what you know blah blah blah. Yani with mingi. So uh, at that moment when I'm feeling the good the feel good energy, immediately I start feeling guilty because um my other best friend, Amani yep i had promised her way before when i told her that um we are planning to have a baby when we are having that chat i we, we like we promised each other that she'll be the first person to know that i'm pregnant and now i start feeling guilty because i've shared the news first with my other best friend anyway guys Later on, there's something that I do that I pretend that I don't know that, like, okay, how am I going to explain this? Later on, I pretend, no, later on, I go visit my other friend. Now, to me, book a story. To me, book a story. I'll take you back again. Later on, I pretend and I go to my best friend, now my other best friend, Amani, and I tell her, I think I could be pregnant and she tells me I think this is the moment we promised each other that we are going to test together and confirm that we are pregnant together so in fact she's the one who now goes ahead to buy me a pregnancy test we go to her house and we test and the results are positive but guys I don't know how to pretend like I don't seem shocked and she's like, why are you not shocked? Why are you not excited? Deep down, I know the reason why I'm not shocked and I'm not over excited. It's because I knew I'm pregnant, but I just wanted her to have that moment of feeling like she is the one to find out. <laughs> I'm really sorry, friend, but that is what happened. I've never told her, so she'll probably find out this in this. She'll probably find out this information in this vlog and then we start having plans of our baby what what not nini 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 anyway guys now back nilikuwa nimewapeleka fast forward now back i start feeling good um i start thinking when i'll just pamper my baby how i'll be a happy mom Oh no, my baby cannot be waking up right now. And at this moment, guys, remember my boyfriend is still out, have chased him, and he has not got he has not any come back already. Oh my god, my baby is awake. Guys, I think I'll post a part two of this video. Uh, of where now the juice is. Like I'll now tell you the whole story of how what happened next afterwards but afterwards is a positive thing because i stopped feeling confused and i started feeling confident about myself about my situation and what i'm about to to experience anyway guys subscribe like share and make sure you watch for a part two bye bye